What's up guys, it's Jimmy here and welcome back to another GT Online video and today I'm doing a live commentary and you guys could probably already tell what the video is going to be about but as requested I'm going to be showcasing to you guys my Aponte Dukes in GT Online and you guys may already tell that my vehicle kinda, I kinda wanted to make it look like the Dukes O Death because I was actually really upset that that you know one in particular vehicle did not come to GT online and it was only exclusive for single player but nevertheless I tried to make my vehicle look as well as possible I'm also not a high enough level to get certain customizations but I am gonna be showing you guys my customization for this awesome vehicle and I have to say guys and I think I can speak for a lot of people that you know a lot of you guys are happy about this vehicle coming to GTA cuz this is definitely a really step up vehicle like I'm, I'm glad we got something new like this and as well as the Marshall these are really nice vehicles that we got but as always be sure to drop a sexual like on this video guys you know how much I love it when you guys leave a like and also if you're new to my channel make sure you guys subscribe and also be sure to leave your comments in the comment section below and if you guys would do your Aponte Dukes a different way let me know how you guys would do it down in the comments but let's get started I'm not gonna really go to armor or uh, brakes or <laughs> whatever I'm just gonna go to like some of the customizations that actually show the outer you know part so let's go to the um, bumpers first I got the custom front splitter because there's not really you know there's only four out of all this and this is like the stock front bumper so I don't really I don't really care about that so I have the custom here and I also have the stock rear bumper because I don't really like the wheelie bar I mean some of you guys may but I don't I'm not feeling it so also with the exhaust I would do the dual it looks really nice especially on the Dukes but I had it on side exit you know exhaust because it looks it looks really um uh, I would say different and unique fancy I like it I like it I like it a lot so yeah so let's go to the hood and with the hood, if you guys are high enough level, you guys should definitely get the single intake bug catcher. As you guys can see, this looks really nice. And if you guys are wanting to make your vehicle an online look like the Duke So Death, I definitely would add this customization on because it, you know, the Duke So Death has the exact same thing. Now, um, I actually had to put on the Ram Air Hood, and I like this other than the carbon hood or the performance hood I mean the performance hood looks nice but I like the ram hood better I guess you guys could say I don't know I just like it now the next one I want to show you guys is you know I should have put on neon lights but for this vehicle since I was wanting to make it look like the Duco death I didn't really want to put on neon lights but you guys can customize it the way you want to with the neon lights um I didn't put on a roll cage either again I was making it wanting to look like the Duco death but for the roof, I did put the painted roof on there. Stock doesn't look really, you know, any different when you have a black color car. But if you guys put on the painted roof, it looks way better than just a stock roof. So that's just my full opinion. Um, the spoiler, I don't, I'm not really feeling the mid, you know, level spoiler. It's, it's really nothing. And I just, just decided not to put it on. Um, if I had lower suspension, I would have put it like all the way here. But only got it there, guys. Um, transmission, turbo, definitely put turbo on the vehicle, um, or wait, maybe turbo, uh, I'm not too sure, go right ahead, what do you want to do? Um, and for the wheel type, I think I decided to go off-road, right, and rock crawler, there we go, and I just wanted to make it look, you know, like the Duke So Death, guys, again, I am a very big fan of that vehicle, if you guys haven't tried it in single player, it's a beast, oh my god, I wish they added that car to the online, you know, so people can have it, but I guess definitely could see how it would be you know definitely game breaking and something very impossible for someone to kill because it's really really bulletproof guys but there is spots where you can kill someone where there's no bulletproof and for the windows I put the dark smoke on but that is really it for my customization of the Dukes I have to say guys this is an awesome vehicle really good with drifting it's uh it has a good speed performance I guess you guys could say because it's not a slow vehicle yet it's not super fast but it definitely I've seen races where people have raced with the Amponte Dukes and actually won against an adder or won against certain other vehicles in the game so this is a fast vehicle I'm not gonna lie um it's a nice one here's the interior of the vehicle but let me know guys in the comment section right now I'm doing some crazy spins how would you do your Amponte Dukes 
and do you guys even have the Aponte Dukes? And were you happy when it came out? So just let me know all your feedback down in the comments, guys. I like doing these types of videos. So yeah, with that being said, I hope you guys did enjoy. Don't forget to drop a like and share this video with a friend. And with that being said, I love you guys, and I'll catch you in the next one.